InDesign CC users can now create more interactive EPUB ebooks than ever before, with new features that allow you to create pop up footnotes for EPUB 3. Let me show you how it works. In InDesign CC, to actually work with footnotes and export those as pop up footnotes for EPUB 3. So let's zoom into here a second, just so you can see what I've actually done. Here's my footnote reference, and here is the text of the footnote. Now, when I export my InDesign document to EPUB, I have to tell InDesign to do some things for me. And let me show you. Under File, Export, I will now go here and choose, of course, the EPUB format. I'm going to call this Outdoors Rufus and say Save. And at that point, bear in mind that you need to choose version 3, EPUB version 3, to have the pop-up footnotes. So let's choose EPUB 3. And down here, and you will notice that this is new, I can decide on the footnote placement in my EPUB. So is it at the end of the section, such as an endnote, or after the paragraph where the footnote appears? Or what I want to do here is inside a pop-up for EPUB 3. Okay. So once I've exported that EPUB, and loaded it into my iBooks application on the iPad, this is what it would look like. Let me go over here and start sharing my screen. Let me grab my iPad for a second and share the screen. And this is actually the same exact EPUB that I've exported from InDesign. And then if I go over here to the page that has the footnote, if I touch the footnote number, what will happen in iBooks is that this footnote opens automatically. And then, simply by touching outside of, a, of the footnote, the footnote closes, and I can continue my reading in iBooks. Of course, that makes it much, much easier for our readers to access those footnotes. So as you can see, these features work on iBooks right now. So of course, we are aware that not all of the things that you can export out of InDesign work on any device right now. But what we want to do is to make sure that InDesign gives you the tools to actually publish for any device. So if you are publishing to a device that you know can support these pop-up footnotes, well, InDesign is ready for that. A few other EPUB enhancements in InDesign CC include smarter text handling on export, including more accurate representation of text color, tables, and nested styles. But it also has an improved handling of native InDesign objects. So there is a smarter packaging of files, file names, and metadata, and also a better support for Japanese and Middle Eastern language EPUBs. For example, for Japanese, uh, there's an improved support for, uh, for Ruby, J vertical composition. And for Middle Eastern, there's a more complete handling of right to left direction languages. The new EPUB features in InDesign CC allow you to create richer, more interactive ebook reading experiences than ever before. And these are just a few of the exciting new features included in InDesign CC, which is only available in Creative Cloud. Uh -huh.